In this video, I want to talk about the different types of WhatsApp marketing funnels. Now, when you see some people running ads on Facebook to their WhatsApp, you may be wondering what kind of funnel are they using, what structure or, or strategy are they using. So I want to explain some of the funnels that most of them use. Okay, I will be explaining the three most common whatsapp marketing funnels that many people or most advertisers use all right so now this is the first one this funnel is quite simple now look at how it goes from your facebook ad you send your target audience to an opt-in page or landing page okay now from this landing page they will click on a button that will take them to whatsapp either your whatsapp dm or your whatsapp group or they will enter their details in the opt-in page and after entering their details in the opt-in page they will now be redirected to your whatsapp or to the whatsapp group so it means that the redirection should be your whatsapp link either your whatsapp link of direct message or whatsapp link to a group okay here also there is a facebook campaign called lead generation campaign okay now you can as well use this lead generation campaign for this kind of adverts now from your facebook ad they will fill a form on facebook this time around they are not leaving facebook they will fill a form on facebook enter their name their email their phone number according to the details you want now after they have successfully filled that form on facebook now facebook will now give them a page still on facebook that they have to click and they will be redirected to anywhere else you want so now here the redirection will now be to your whatsapp or to your whatsapp group either your whatsapp dm or your whatsapp group link so every redirection since we are dealing with whatsapp should be either your whatsapp link or your whatsapp group so you can use this funnel for your facebook to whatsapp advert okay and um the the, the objective you can use here is traffic objective the campaign you can use is traffic campaign okay it works for this kind of um, funnel now this is from your Facebook to your landing page then to your whatsapp or to your lead generation and um, form on Facebook to your whatsapp so for the opt-in page or landing page you can use traffic campaign many people use traffic campaign then for the lead generation on Facebook you have to use lead generation campaign objective there is a campaign objective on facebook called lead generation so you use that one then for placement placement has to do with where you want the advert to be showing do you want it to be showing on computer or mobile phone or boot so since we are sending them to whatsapp many people don't have whatsapp on their computer so whatsapp is popularly a phone app so your your placement should be mobile ads okay it should be people using their mobile phone that will see your advert so that once they click on the landing page or on the button or on the link wherever you place it either at the thank you page or in the landing page they will be redirected to their whatsapp without stress okay now the next funnel you should consider is from facebook to your whatsapp dm then from your WhatsApp DM, you can send them to your group if you if you are trying to hold a, a, a class or from your WhatsApp DM, you can start marketing to them or selling to them whatever you have to offer. Okay, this is another simple um, funnel that people use. Now, in this funnel, um, Facebook will automatically send them to your WhatsApp and you must integrate your WhatsApp to your um, to your Facebook page and to your Instagram page if you want to use Instagram as well okay so 
from Facebook to your WhatsApp directly. And this this ad, the WhatsApp you have to use is your business WhatsApp. If you cannot link the normal WhatsApp to your Facebook, it, it has to be your business WhatsApp. Okay, so from from your WhatsApp, from your Facebook to your WhatsApp, then to a group or you sell whatever you want to sell to them or you save their contacts, whatever is your purpose of sending them to your WhatsApp. As soon as they land on your WhatsApp, then you start um, working towards actualizing that purpose okay so here the campaign you, you should use is message objective okay once you once you choose message campaign objective um facebook will ask you do you want to send them to your messenger do you want to send them to your instagram inbox or you want to send them to your whatsapp okay now you can select um, your whatsapp since we are talking about whatsapp here okay now automatically once you once you select whatsapp facebook will automatically make the placement mobile ad it will become a mobile ad okay now there is one thing people do at times people run ad to their whatsapp whatsapp directly not using whatsapp business they may be making use of the normal um, whatsapp or making use of um, gb whatsapp or any other whatsapp that is not whatsapp business okay um, there is a risk there running um, ad directly to that kind of whatsapp can pose chances of bringing in um, low quality individuals okay it can make your audience low it can reduce the quality of your audience and at times it, it may attract rejection of your ad and possibly um, banning your ad account or restricting your ad account okay so if you must run directly to whatsapp without using a landing page then it is advisable you use whatsapp business and integrate it to your um, facebook and instagram then continue your ad all right so the third one here is a little bit complex but i will explain it to you now this is your facebook ad to your landing page or to your opt-in page okay an opt-in page is a, a single page where visitors visit to read about a product or to have an information a specific information and at the end of the page or in between the page you will have either forms or buttons call to actions that these people who visited this page ought to click to take certain actions okay so here from your facebook to your landing page or to your opt-in page now it sends them to to your thank you page now this works for people who have websites okay you have websites then this this first one also um, work for people who have websites and those that don't have websites but you are using um, third-party websites that allow you to um, design free websites on their platform this first strategy works for you okay now this one works for those that have websites now you have your website you design your opt-in page or landing page you have your thank you page now you send um, traffic to your landing page or opt-in page okay then after once they sign up or they click on that call to action button it will take them to the thank you page where you thank them for signing up for the free gift or the ethical bribe or whatever you have promised them okay now in in order to get the free gift or whatever you promise them they on the thank you page there will be a button for them to click click and then um, contact you on your whatsapp or join a whatsapp group okay now because you are using an opt-in page there is need for an email autoresponder okay so now once the opt-in the autoresponder takes their data that is takes their 
email and their phone number and their name okay now after they get to the thank you page they will receive a mail okay and inside that mail too contains a link that sends them to your whatsapp okay so um if you are working with this funnel then you must have a landing page and an autoresponder as well okay you have to have a thank you page as well so from your from your facebook to your opt-in page or to your squeeze page opt-in page squeeze page landing page they are the same thing okay then to your thank you page where you thank them for taking certain actions then you now give them a link to click to your whatsapp to get whatever you have promised them and also in your email too once they opt in yeah i mean their data is being sent to your email autoresponder then your autoresponder sends them an email a follow-up email telling them to click on the link in the email to access whatever they want to access and once they click on that link it should bring them to your whatsapp or your whatsapp group okay now also here you can as well use the facebook um, um, lead generation form in replacement of of your of your opt-in page now if you must do that then you have to link your autoresponder to your facebook lead generation form okay there are some autoresponders that are co that are compatible with facebook you can link them up so as soon as they fill in their data on facebook it is being sent to the autoresponder then they are also sent to a thank you page then from the thank you page to your whatsapp okay so you can as well use the facebook lead generation form for this funnel all right so now the best campaign for this funnel is conversion objective specifically lead okay you have to set up conversion objective and to do that you have to install facebook pixel on your site okay you have to um, install it on your site then you also install the lead event pixel okay the event pixel once you install the general pixel on your site now on your thank you page you need to insert the lead pixel event pixel on your thank you page so that once they land there facebook ad will in, in um will um will understand that yes you have gotten a lead somebody has signed up from facebook okay so here you need to use conversion objective and to do that you need to set up pixel on your website okay now here you may not need the pixel because you are using traffic objective but here you need it because you are using conversion objective okay now the placement here can be both mobile and computer your ad can show for uh, mobile and computer or only mobile alone so these are the three funnels that many people use when they are running ads to their whatsapp okay so once you use these funnels once you use any of them and understand them you are going to actually get good results from them thank you